Today, the Manhattan Country School is a place where equity and diversity are celebrated and where sustainability is, is our, our, very much our mission, both at the farm in Roxbury and at our campus in New York City. I'm happy to be making our electricity without burning coal or running a nuclear power plant, and I'm satisfied that our excess will go into the grid and reduce the amount of fossil-produced fuel used by the public, while at the same time reducing our own school's carbon footprint here and in the city. And just before this, I had Kathy check our meter, and according to our meter, we have saved 407 pounds of carbon since we turned it on on Friday. The sense of community that pulled this together is very strong. I could point to almost any students and all kinds of organizations that helped them reach their goal when it came their time to add to what it took us to produce this project. As the school was embarking on this amazing project to install solar panels at the farm, we decided to hop on board and we developed a walkathon at the end of last year to raise money, as you've already heard, um, to help uh, with the installation of the solar panels. Hi, I'm Janet Ortiz and it was easy for us to decide on, to take on this project, especially because we were already focusing on environment environment sustainability and the next step was to be energy efficient. Hi I'm Juna Seamus and I'm in the eighth grade. Um, the project was so successful thanks to all the efforts from the students, teachers, parents and alumni. Everyone worked hard whether walking, fundraising or organizing. It was a community effort. Hi um, I'm Pablo Tamarin. Um, my first reaction when I got to the farm was when I saw these was wow. <laughs> It was very amazing <laughs> at first sight. I mean, these things are huge. <laughs> and, and I didn't think our, our walk would, could do it, but we did. This is a magical place. And we want nothing better than to see this place be even more magical. And this is what we have. <laughs>